What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. You're watching Tom Trips Out, and in this episode, I'm at Snack World Co. Cambodia. My name's Tom, this is my trip out. Well hey everybody, come along with me. Take a trip to a place to find what I see. Make me believe we'll see the joy they bring. And how much it costs to try new things will. Come and watch me on the trip ride. All right, I am out here on Street 315 in Phnom Penh, Cambodia. It's up in an area called TK or Tul Kork. We're going to head inside to Snack World and I'll show you all the limited and exotic snacks they've got here. And it'll be like an, a nostalgic ride down memory lane. You don't want to miss this. Snacks. We're going to start right here and work our way around the whole room and check out all the different stuff and what flavors they have. Starting off up here, Freezies, but they're like Skittles, Warheads, and Jolly Rancher Freezies. Toxic Waste Slime Liquor. <laughs> and then here's Nerds, but they've got Rainbow Flavor, Grape and Strawberry, and then Nerds Gummy Clusters. So it's like a gummy with nerds all around it. I don't know about you guys, but we never had like a nerds gummy clusters when I was growing up. So already that's a, f a couple of flavors I've never even heard of before. And they, that would be only available in this store, unless if you like ordered it from America yourself. Here's a few other candies from my childhood. Bubble tape, push pops, and bottle pops. So next it moves into like gummies. We have Sour Patch Kids, Swedish Fish, Gushers. These Gushers I used to get in my lunch every day as a little kid in like grade school. So crazy to see them here in Cambodia. They've got Trident gum, but it's, the flavor is a special Sour Patch limited time flavor. Sour Patch flavor Trident gum. A couple combo packs here where you get a little bit of everything. Push pops, bottle pop, cotton candy, and right now it's the beginning of April so they have some Easter treats here. Rice Krispie Square uh, treats and Peeps party cake. So they're like the, I think this is very popular in America. It's moving into chocolate bars, Reese cups, and down there, they even have a special Kit Kat that I've never seen before. Check this out. Chocolate Frosted Donut Kit Kat. Classic Twinkies. So earlier today, I went out for lunch with the owner of this place and he was letting me know like the business model and how they decide what things to stock his store with. And they're basically keeping an eye on all the brand new trending candy flavors or bags of chips or chocolate bars or drinks that are coming out with brand new flavors or limited time flavors and they get them flown in from the US and what's important about that is they're not doing it slowly by, by sea it's being done on a plane so that way it gets here quickly it's still on trend and it's still new on top of that the shelf life would, is gonna last way longer because it was able to get here faster instead of spending most of its life sitting on a boat for months on the, coming to Cambodia as a result of the way they're bringing these in and the flavors and the shelf life it does affect the price a little bit but this is meant for like when you really miss home or you have someone special you want to buy them a nice treat this is like the higher end of snacking Moving along, there's fruit roll-ups. Who out there remembers getting these in their lunches growing up? Leave a comment below. And they have some cereals here too. Reese Puffs, Rice Krispies, Lucky Charms. And then when you get to the back of the store, they have Takis, Doritos, Cheetos, all kinds of chips with limited flavors that some of them you may have never even heard of before. Check this out. So we've got Dragon Sweet Chili. Guacamole, Nitro, Intense Nacho, Fuego, 
And then there's some Doritos here, paprika flavor. And then fire and spicy pizza. And you reach the back of the store, and there's a fridge here of prime energy drinks. These were made famous by an uh, online influencer. And he has a special like cherry flavor that has a special bottle where when it's room temperature, it looks like this. But when it gets cold, the bottle turns blue to show you that it's cold and ready to enjoy. So if you're missing home and you want to spoil yourself, this is the place to come to get a treat that will bring you back to your childhood. And if you're just passing through quickly and you need to satisfy, you know, just a small quick sugar fix, they've got a side wall here with all kinds of little bags of sour gummies and candies. There's even a special one down here called a magic straw. I'll show you that. So this is like a straw that's full of little candy pellets. And it's meant for kids that uh, don't want to drink their milk. You can like give them this straw and it, as the milk passes through it makes it taste like sweeter like candy so they'll drink their milk. It's called a magic straw. They have these candy filled ropes. And also popping candy. Remember Pop Rocks? You put these on your tongue and they start popping and exploding. And then super sour gummies. And if you end up coming in here and you're a health nut and you're turning your nose up at all these things because you don't like sugar, they have something for you too. There's a Jolly Rancher gummy with zero sugar. One of the major things here that caught my eye is Pop-Tarts. I used to love those as a kid. But there's some flavors of Pop-Tarts here I've never even heard of. Not, e not only not tried, I've never even heard of them. Check these out, I'll show you them. So we've got Hot Fudge Sunday Pop-Tarts. Wildberry. Actually, this one I've had before. Frosted S'mores. I think I've seen that one. But look at this. Banana Bread Pop-Tarts. So if you're missing any of these treats from home, you should come to this higher-end snack store, Snack World. So I'm gonna grab a couple of small things. Start with Swedish fish. I think this is the one everyone's from already familiar with. Fan favorite. Little red gummies like in the shape of a fish. Oh yeah. It's just like Swedish berries, you know, but in the shape of a fish. If you want to relive your childhood. Get some of these and some fruit roll-ups and a push pop and you're back to being 10 years old again. <laughs> this is like a, a type of chip and you can see that it's kind of like a chip that's rolled up into a tube. But it'll be crunchy. It's like a Dorito that's rolled up into a tube shape. And this one's called Blue Heat. So they, they're going to be like a blue color. So it's exactly what I said. It's like a it's basically a Dorito that's rolled up into a tube and it's got blue powder on it. Wow. It's like spicy but tastes like blue raspberry at the same time. Makes everything you touch blue. <laughs> Careful with this one. Alright, that's going to do it for this episode. Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button. And until next time, remember, how you spend your days is the way you spend your life. It's never too late to start tripping out.